Hi, this is Jake from Optimus Futures, and in this video, I'll be showing you how to log into a live or demo account, or create yourself a new demo account on the MetaTrader 5 mobile trading app. So as you can see here, we're currently on the homepage of the MetaTrader 5 mobile trading app. This is the quotes page. Now, keep in mind before we move on, I would like to mention that I'm using the Android version of MetaTrader 5 mobile. Now, pretty much all the features here should be the same across both versions, both Apple and Android. Some of the menu icons and configurations may look a little bit different or the keyboard and things like that just became because I am using the Android operating system. But other than a few menu differences, everything features wide should remain the same. So that being said, if you want to log into an existing live account or demo account or create your new demo account, simply click on the hamburger icon. This is a menu button in the very top left hand corner next to quotes. And then click on the manage accounts button, which is the link, the blue link at the very top. Now, once you've clicked on accounts or manage accounts, you'll see a list here of all the different accounts you have associated with this app. As you can see, I have two. One is a futures account and one is the default MetaTrader 5 Android demo. This connects to Forex data. Now, because we are an introducing broker to futures, we're going to show you how to connect to a live or demo futures account. So if you have an existing live or demo account or you want to create a new demo account, you'll need to click the plus button in the top right hand corner. And then you'll need to click on find a broker. Now, by default, I don't think AMP will show up here. So if you are a customer of ours, we will be putting you with AMP. If you are using MT5 as your main platform, these are going to be using AMP servers provided by CQG data. So for our demo users as well, AMP is kind enough to allow us to allow our demo users, the AMP global servers, to create yourself a free live paper trading account. So either way, we're going to want to type in AMP. Excuse my typing here. I'm a little bit messed up. So we'll type in AMP. And as you can see, there's two different servers. There's a European server. So if you're located in Europe or somewhere in the East, please choose this option. If you're anywhere in the West or in the USA, click on the USA option. Either way will bring you to the following screen. Now you have two options here. You have the demo server. So if you have an existing demo account that you've been practicing with, maybe on your PC, and then you wanted to try the demo on the mobile app, you can use those existing demo credentials here to log in. Otherwise, if you're a live customer of ours or another broker and are looking to log into your live AMP account, simply choose the AMP Global USA Live option under server type, and then type in the username and password that either us or AMP has provided you with. Once you've entered it in, simply click login and you'll automatically be connected to the live CQG um, AMP Global server. Now, if you are a first time user, and you haven't tried a demo before and you don't have any existing credentials, click on the open a demo account option at the very top of the page. You'll see it says open a demo account to learn trading and to test your strategies. Click on the arrow facing to the right and you'll just need to fill out a bit of information here. Fill out your first and last name, your phone number. Keep in mind that you'll need to put your country tag uh, leading your phone number. So for us, we need to put the one in front of our number there. You'll notice if we try to do the condensed version, it'll, it won't allow us, our number's not long enough. So for USA guys, we'll have to put a uh, one in front of us or your respective country code for whatever country you're in. Other than that, you'll have to enter in your email address, the server type, which of course is going to be demo. Your account type, which your only options here is demo futures. Here you can actually adjust your leverage either to one to 200 or one to one, depending on what you prefer and what you think your live account will be set at. Here you can put in a custom deposit amount. So by default, it's $10,000. You can do 500,000, a million, five, 5 million, whatever you like. From there, simply click on the accept button and then click on register. 
You'll see it provides you with a username and password. You can copy it in the very top right. You may want to write these down as well. And they actually provide you with a link for the desktop version. Once you have everything copied down, click on done. And here we can select from the different trading accounts that we have in the MetaTrader 5 app. So if you want to, you can switch back to a Forex account. You can simply click on our MetaTrader demo to log in. in. We'll just long cl click, press and hold, and you'll see that login or delete option comes up. We can delete it if we want. As you can see, we're automatically logged in to the demo account, or we can switch back and forth between our old account by again, pressing and holding on the account option. So now that we're logged into a live account, we can head back to quotes and we should be able to, and as you can see, there are already some on there, find some futures trading contracts. Now by default, the ones on our quote board are look like continuous contracts. You can tell that it's represented with an at symbol in front of it. If you want, we can type in the um, actual contract to trade on. So for example, we can type in ES, well here's micro ES, I believe CQG symbols EP, Z, there we go, EPZ19. We can click on that. It'll automatically add it to our quote board here. You can see this is a tradable contract because it's highlighted black or bolded rather than grayed out as you can see above. See here's the continuous contract for the EP. I was just long click clicking and pressing on it. That's continuous so Although we can receive data for it, we can't actually trade off of it. So if you want to go and place a live trade now, simply left click on, or just, excuse me, tap on the EPZ19 contract. Obviously this will differentiate between trader to trader, depending on what contract you want to trade. From here, you can open up a chart or place an order. As you can see, here's our little order execution window. And we could just click buy if we want to, and our order has been placed. And that's pretty much gonna wrap it up for this video. Just quickly wanted to show you how to connect to the live or demo servers, uh, future servers that is, on the MetaTrader 5 mobile app. If you do have any questions, please post them in the comment section below or head over to our community forum. It's also linked down in the description. You're more than welcome to ask questions there. Please subscribe if you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up. And you can also subscribe for future trading podcasts, tips, psychology, and much more. And as always, thanks for watching.